All right, we are here with Michigan women's lacrosse coach Hannah Nielsen. Uh, you guys are heading out to Maryland tomorrow for the Big Ten women's lacrosse tournament. Um, you guys, for the very first time, Michigan's going to be in it. Um, before we get to that, let's start at the beginning of the season. Overall, regular season, you've had a pretty successful one, 14-2 and two on the year. Um, overall, talk about the season so far. Yeah, I think that the season um, it went really well. I think it's hard when you're in the moment to really kind of look back and reflect, but I think when it's all said and done, I'll be able to look, look back and um, be really proud about what we've accomplished. Um, I, I think at the beginning of the year, I certainly hoped that we would win some games um, along the way and more than we won last year, but... Uh, to, to think that we you know are in a position where we've only lost a couple of games, I think it's something I'm I'm really proud of, and I hope we can keep it keep it going. You know, kind of going back to that, you you got here last year, and this is your only second year with the team. And how big of a turnaround was this from year one to year two? What, what do you think the biggest challenge was, and what do you think was the biggest contributor to that turnover? Well, I, I think I think as coaches, um, my team and my staff has has done a great job. And, and we've done a great job just in that first year of really not overlooking anything. I think in year one, we really laid the foundation down and made sure not to skip anything, not not skip over anything too quickly, and really teach uh, the fundamentals that we wanted to see. Uh, and now in year two, you we were still teaching the same things, but the girls are just picking it up quick, you know, more quickly. And even just this week in practice, um, concepts that we were doing last year, we that we've been bringing back. Uh, they're just remembering them, and I think that's you know a testament to the fundamentals that we've learned along the way. Um, so I just think it's been a, it's been a constant build, and the position we're in now uh, has just been you know step by step along the way, not skipping a beat, not not rushing over anything um, to try and get ahead. It's just been a slowly you know uphill steady increase. What do you think's been some of the biggest contributors? You know, you look at Mag, um, you look at Kane, you look at Lily Grass, and you look at Mira Shane. Who do you think stood out for you? You know, I think the best thing, and, and not to sound like a cliche answer, is that everyone's stepping up on any any given day. I think Mira in the back line obviously anchors the defense, but then you've got Maddie Rich, uh, who's doing a great job and picks up the opposition's top top offensive player, you know, week in, week out. Um, the rest of the defensive unit is is just tough, you know, for all one through four defenders are great. Uh, Morgan Whitaker stepped up as a freshman defender in recent weeks, and then as you go down the line, Molly and Maggie, uh, Molly Garrett, Maggie Kane make a you know unreal one-two combo in the middle. Um, and then offensively, you know Adriana Pendino started the season strong, had a little dip, but then Caitlin Muir steps up, and then Nadine Stewart's been a great target in the middle for us. Lily Grass has had her good day, so I, I truly think that every individual, and we say this week in week out, has gotten this much better every single week. And it's um, that's what we've had to do, and then it's got us to the point that we're at now. Coming up, Northwestern, um, your first matchup in the Big Ten Women's Lacrosse Tournament. You just played them a couple weeks ago. What do you think? And of course, you went to Northwestern, so you kind of know the program a little bit. What do you think needs to happen the, in this game that didn't happen in the last one? Well, I think we're going to have to play exactly like we did, and a little better. You know, there was definitely we played about probably fifty minutes of good lacrosse. Uh, last time we played them and we let it slip at the end of the game. I think Northwestern's going to come out stronger. They're obviously going to change some things up and, and play harder than they did, so we're going to have to expect that from them. Um, we have to shoot a little better. Uh, we have to get the ball out of the center uh, a little more than we did, uh, and we're just going to have to play similarly on defense to how we played. I think our defense played really well, um, held them to a lower lower average than their you know, lower total than their average, uh, so it's going to have to be a near-perfect game for us because we know the Northwestern extremely talented team are going to come out and give us a little bit more but I, I, I'm excited about the matchup and I'm excited that um, it's fresh in our head what happened last time then we know what to correct. All right, Hannah thank you very much and good luck this weekend. Thank you.